Hi everybody. Uh, sorry about uh, the audio quality. Um, we couldn't find the mic today, so we're just improvising. But today I'm going to go through the new version of my survival kit. I know, I know, I know. I did update it like a few weeks ago. Itchy nose. A few weeks ago, but uh, then I uh, decided to move it into this bigger pack, which is more comfortable and obviously fits more. Now, again, with the carabiner and rope, uh, I will have to mention this again. Neither of these are to be used for climbing, okay? I won't go off on a rant like I did last time. Oh. Probably just better if I leave it down here. Uh, first, we have a rain jacket. Uh, this was actually suggested by my mum, who's also filming me. Hi, mum. <laughs> yeah, uh, it also is in this stuff sack, so. I can just open it and pull it out and it becomes a full rain jacket. Uh, yeah. Fudge. Next up, we have a folding shovel. Yeah. If you've probably seen these at like Kmart before and that's where I got mine from Kmart. But hey, it's decent. How much did it cost? Uh, uh, eight fifty for the price. It's decent. Can be a little bit fiddly sometimes though. Uh, fudge. Lefty, loosey, righty, tighty. Just leave it like that over there. Uh, next, uh, we have my folding saw. This is the most recent addition. Uh, just open like that. Now, one thing you do have to be careful about is that these are very sharp, so do not touch them. With your hands. Uh, next up, snake bite first aid kit. As I said in the last video, uh, it's practically essential to have one of these in Australia since, well, you gotta get snake bites, uh, every year, like, once every day, and if that happens to you or the family, well then, handy to have one. Uh, next up, a pocket first aid kit. Now, no, this is not meant to be extensive. It just has the very basic essentials. Okay, uh, wait, forgot to pack this up. Okay, uh, how to pack this back up? Yeah. Sorry, these are very fiddly things sometimes.
next up, I've got some more rope, uh, 10 meters of additional rope, uh, antibacterial wipes, uh, now for those of you who watched uh, my previous survival kit video, um, you'll know these are meant to be used as toilet paper. Let's just hope we don't go through any more shortages of that specific product. Uh, compass uh, for navigation. I actually only recently learned how to use a compass. I used to think whatever direction it was pointing was the direction uh, like, if it, the needle was pointing east, that was east. No, it always points north. And a deck of cards. Yeah. Well, just like in the last video, mental health reasons. Okay, uh, I'm just getting all the bags out of this can take a bit. Okay. Okay. First up, dental kit. Uh, just has a toothbrush and a really small tube of toothpaste. Uh, uh, but body wash and soap, uh, yeah, uh, food and water bag, now I did add some food into this in case you were wondering, uh, got some salt either for rehydration or seasoning. I've got some fishing line wrapped around the toothpick. Uh, uh, a water bag, which is just a Ziploc bag wrapped in some tape. And an extra fishing hook, just in case this one fails. Uh, Myla sleeping bag and Myla blanket. Now, the sleeping bag obviously is a sleeping bag, but the blanket it is not meant to be used as a sorry about that uh, as a blanket. It's meant to be used as a tent. Uh, next up, got the first aid bag. Now. I forgot to mention there were two first aid supplies. Okay, first up, one, two, three, four, five. Uh, five of these individual, uh, no, ten individual alcohol swabs, which are just tied together. Uh, Sewing needle and thread, uh, in case I have to do what's called a suture. Uh, you basic now. It's basically where you just it's stitches, okay? They're stitches. Uh, I've got four larger band aids, and then I've got four smaller band aids. Up next, the final bag is our tool bag. Uh, I've got pencil and paper for stock tape taking and as a reference. Uh, trash bag. Now, this isn't the only trash bag. There are a few more. Uh, nails. 
uh, which are meant to be used with something we'll see later in the kit. Uh, spooler tape wrapped around a toothpick and a Swiss Army knife. Okay, now I'm trying to pack this all up again. Packing up, do do do. 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 Do do do, packing up. 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 Do do do. Oh yeah, fire bag. Uh, just got matches, striker, cotton ball impregnated with wax, and some fire cord. Okay, and okay. Uh, trying to put this off back in its pouch. Next up, I have two trash bags for water storage or as an improvised shelter. Up next, uh, we've got our last item, which is a food item, uh, a tub of rice. Yeah. That's all I have. A double wraps. I will add more food, but for now, this is what I'm sticking with. Okay, guys, I realize comments are turned off since uh, I'm a kid friendly YouTube channel, so uh, yeah. Have a nice evening and peace.